city is expanding the Sand Island Wastewater Treatment Facility. A blessing and groundbreaking ceremony was recently held for a second egg-shaped digester and sludge storage tank. The mayor says the $30 million expansion is necessary for future development in the area. We do need this digester. This facility right here serves everything a little bit outside of White Kite, all the way along the coast, all the way into town, and going all the way to where? Red Hill? Red Hill. That's our dense urban core. This is where development is going to be occurring. Councilmember Joey Monahan, whose district includes Sand Island, supports the project. We need the capacity, and uh, not to mention, you know, the first egg already needs maintenance, and the only way we can do it is by building the second egg. So I understand the need. It's been a long time coming. I'm just glad this day has finally come. Sinegro, operator of the plant, says expansion will improve system reliability and redundancy. The first digester went into operation in 2007 and is running at capacity. Through bioconversion, the digester turns sewage sludge into fertilizer, sending less waste to the landfill. Construction on the expansion project should be completed in two years.